This review is all about the Uhomi WCC bottom loading water cooler dispenser. It's one of the top options in the market, offering several amazing features like three temperature settings, cold, room temperature, and hot, and a self-cleaning function. It's also attractive, and pretty simple to use with built-in safety mechanisms. It's relatively quiet when running and has indicators that make water bottle replacement simpler. Its overall build quality is pretty good too. Here is our comprehensive review to give you more insight into its performance, usability, installation, and overall quality. The first impressive thing about this Uhomi WCC water cooler is that it offers three functions. You can draw cold, hot, and room temperature water, which is quite convenient as it gets to cover all your water needs. All three functions work really well. The cooling process is very effective. The Uhomi's compressor is able to cool the water down from 46.41 to 51 degrees Fahrenheit. However, some users reported getting water that's around 36 degrees Fahrenheit, which is colder than the range specified by Uhomi. That means you can get almost ice cold water with this unit which is great considering that most standard coolers tend to deliver cold water that's just slightly colder than room temperature water. The heating function of the Uhomi WCC water cooler utilizes a 420W heating element which heats the water to temperatures as high as 185 to 194 degrees Fahrenheit. Therefore, you get steaming hot water. Ideal for making a cup of coffee? tea, or even your meals. The water becomes hot very fast, within just 5 minutes of turning on the heating function. The heating capacity is also decent. It's able to produce around 5 liters of hot water within an hour, which is equal to around 20 cups or more of coffee. The Uhomi WCC is pretty simple to operate. It uses push buttons to dispense water from the respective spigots. These buttons are more convenient and easier to use compared to push down levers. To draw cold water, you just press down the button and keep holding it until you've dispensed the amount of water you want, then release it. You do the same when you want to draw room temperature water. However, it's a little different from hot water. The hot water button has a child safety lock which you have to push forward and then press down the button at the same time to begin the flow of the hot water. You have to hold the safety lock to get the hot water, otherwise, nothing comes out. The lock will reset to the locked position automatically immediately after you release the button. It's an important safety feature for houses with small kids as they will not be able to use it hence preventing them from dispensing the hot water and accidentally burning themselves. The Uhomi WCC water cooler comes well packed and many reported that it arrives in perfect condition. You won't really have to worry about scratches and dents. Setting it up is straightforward and doesn't involve many steps because it's just installing the water bottle and the drip tray. To install the bottle, you first remove the whole plastic cap and paper seal from its top. Once they are off, you place the water straw right into the water bottle all the way to the bottom and then clasp the bottle cap down onto the bottle's neck, ensuring that it's tightly secured to the bottle. From there, you slide the water bottle into the Uhomi WCC water cooler's storage area, cabinet and close the door, there's a ramp to slide the water bottle on. To install the drip tray, you simply place it down into the section at the top of the cooler's door until it snaps securely in place. Once everything is set, the final step is to plug the power cord into a wall outlet, upon which the pump starts to move the water from the bottle to both the cold and hot water tanks. It takes around 5 minutes to fill the two tanks for the first time, after which it stops automatically. With the cooler ready, you just turn the cold and hot water switches to the on position and wait a few minutes for the water to be ready. 
Maintaining this Uhomi WCC water cooler is hassle-free as it's just replacing the water bottles, which the bottom load design has made very convenient and so much easier. You just remove the empty bottle from the cooler and remove the water straw. From there, you simply load the new full water bottle like you did the one you're replacing. Moreover, there's no guessing the right time to change the bottle. The unit comes with an indicator that lets you know when the water bottle is empty. The cooling light and heating light flush simultaneously to alert you to replace the bottle immediately when the water inside it runs out. It's a very convenient feature, especially since the bottle is inside the cabinet where you can't see it like in the top-loading cooler where it's exposed.